Hey, what's up guys? It's Nick uh, White here, and I do tech and coding stuff on Twitch and YouTube. I'm doing all of the Leaco problems, and I have them all on my channel, so if you want to go check those out, I've done a ton of them. Um, this one's called Swap Nodes in Pairs. Uh, given a linked list, swap every two adjacent nodes and return its head. You may not, mod you may not modify the value of the list nodes, or only the nodes itself may change. So I did this at first, and I made a video on it, and I was swapping the values two by two of the nodes and then I read you may not modify the values so I re rethought and then I did it again. So to do this what I do is I declare a temp node because we're actually going to be have to uh, set we're gonna be how do you swap nodes? Well you set the dot next of a node to you skip the node you skip the node after it and you set the next to the node after it of the current node and then you have to kind of swap around and use the next the dot next to kind of swap them. So we'll have, um, we'll go through all the nodes and we'll set the next of the current node that we're at to the one after the next node. And then we'll set the next of the node before that one to the node that was previously next of the current node. So I know that doesn't really make sense. It's hard to explain with the linked lists and all these nexts. It is kind of hard to explain. So, um, we're just going to start writing it out here. So list temp will be equal to noon list node. And we're going to have temp on next point to head. Um, just so we have a kind of a reference uh, to head. And um, then we're going to also have a list node current equals uh, temp. So we're, this is, we're going to use current to loop through. So while current dot next not equal null. Current dot next is going to be ahead at first, so that's where we do that. Next dot next is not equal to null. That's going to be these are going to be the nodes we swap. We're going to say list node first node is equal to current dot next. Uh, list node second node is equal to current dot next dot next. Um, so we grab our two nodes that we're going to swap, and then we set first node dot next equal to second node dot next. Like I said earlier. That's basically taking this first node and it's setting the next to that. And it was the first node's next was second node, but now it's going to be second node dot next. So it's setting the next to skip that. So we're basically taking second node's next and we're making that first node's next because we basically want to make first node become have the same kind of properties as second node. We're we're swapping them, so we want to have some more properties there. Uh, then all we have to do is current dot next. Um, is going to be equal to second node. So we switch the order here because current dot next was first node. Now it's going to be second node, and then current dot next dot next is going to be first node. It was second node. Now it's going to be first node, and then we just have to update current node. Uh, current dot next. Current equals current dot next dot next because we're jumping two at a time as we loop through this linked list. Um, and that's pretty much it. All you have to do is return temp.next because temp's next reference was to the head of the linked list. And there we go, first try, perfect solution. As you see, we grab two nodes at a time, we're looping through the list two nodes at a time, and we're just changing the properties of first and second node. We're changing the next values of the current, the first and the second, um, to kind of change to do a swap between the first node and the second node. Hopefully that made sense to you guys. Let me know in the comments if I did a good job of explaining that. I have all the other videos too, so please go check those out. And thank you guys for watching. See ya.